Okay, so right now we're going to place a signature, but instead of doing it to just one picture, we're going to do it to a bunch of pictures at once, which means in batch. So we are in Photoshop, and first we're going to open a file. We're going to choose one picture, JPEG, and we're going to open it. Okay, then we're going to go to Window and select Actions. And in the Actions tab, we're going to create a new folder. So we're going to name it as Signature, let's say Tutorial for me. You name it as uh, My Signature or whatever name you want to choose. You press OK. Now we just created a folder. Then we're going to create a new action and also create a name for it. So this is says create new action and we're going to put signature and we're going to give it the name as the vertical because it is for vertical pictures and we're going to name it as right because we're going to place the signature on the right. That way we're going to identify what kind of signature we are placing and then we press record. Now Photoshop is recording everything that we do. Then we go to file and we're going to select place embedded. And we're going to search for the file, the signature file. Some pictures. And that's our signature. So we're going to place it. So now we have our signature there and we're going to move it and place it on the picture and right now it's too too small so we're going to resize it and place it wherever we want to place it on the picture for me this is the right place to have my signature but you can choose whatever you want you can put it here there you know whatever works for you again probably the signature is if if you believe it's too um, too bright then you can um, retouch the opacity a little bit let's put it opacity 75 percent okay then we go to file and we're going to select save a copy then we select the format as JPEG we're going to choose save it on the desktop desktop is fine then we we choose a name Let's say signature and we're going to save it and then we go to this page where we're going to choose the quality I have selected maximum which is fine for me and a large file is fine for me we click OK and then we're going to stop our action so this is the stop button and we stop recording now we move to the second step which is automating our action Now we move to the second step, which is automating our action. This is what we are going to do every time you want to place this signature to a bunch of pictures. So we, let's close this. We go to File, we go to Automate, and we go to Batch. Then in the Play section, we're going to select Signature Tutorial which is already selected because I just created them. And then in action, you're going to also select 
Signature Vertical Right. Now it's showing one option because in Signature, in the Signature Tutorial folder, that is the only action that we recorded. But let's say that we did exactly the same, but we created another action to place the signature on the left and we record it and save it as signature vertical left. Then when we pop up this menu, we will have these two options. So you choose whatever action you wanna select, in this case, signature vertical right. And then we're going to choose the source folder of the pictures you want to place the signature in. So then we go to folder and then we choose that folder. So we're going to go to the folder where we have our pictures pictures picture editing camel and baby camel export now we have all the pictures that we want to place the signature so we choose that folder and then uh, we have selected suppress file open option dialogues and suppress color profile warnings you leave that as it is and then we are going to choose the destination folder where the new files with the signature are going to be saved we select the override action, save as comments. And then here we have document name and document name. That's it, it's okay. So we are going to create another folder. Again, to the same folder where we have our exports. And we're going to create another folder. It's sign pictures. And we create and we choose this folder. Now we click OK and that's it. It is exporting all the files with the signature. So now it's done. So let's see, we have the pictures here, all the different versions of the picture we created, and then we have the sign versions, only the JPEG, all right? So you see, we have a bunch of pictures with the signature.